been a little while since I streamed because I've been traveling a lot, but we're gonna pick up where we left off. At the end <clears throat> of the last stream, we got three items because I went through all the dialogue options, 9, 10, 11, our different saves for the different items. I'm gonna go with 10, which was an item for Sunny, because Sunny is squishy. So <laughs> in file 10, we got like an enhanced cookbook that she carries around with her and it increases her health and mana stats. And yeah, it's been a while. I'm a little rusty. I'll do my best to <laughs> emulate the voices. So Vera, our main narrator. It's another day and another awfully early morning. I'll never get used to the girl's love for dawn. Wrong button. There are a lot of crystals left for you to place. Kitty looks at the satchel, still half full. We have yet to visit Florel, but I believe the town has been quarantined. What? There has been an epidemic, and they are trying to contain it by limiting contact with the outside. Right. Vaccines don't exist here. I yawn. What are those? Kitty's eyes gleam with elation. The look suits her beautiful face, but makes me fearful as well. Vaccines don't exist here. Yet. She claps her hands. Girls, I have a mission for you. She looks at us and squints. Wait, vaccines are a bit too advanced. Maybe an antibiotic like penicillin would be easier to acquire. Uh, Celia. Gosh darn it, Celia's voice. I feel like, I don't know, is it like Spanish-y? So... <laughs> Reniel, when I first heard her voice, I'm like, oh, she kind of sounds Spanish, but I'll just make her more Latin. And then when I tried imitating Celia's voice, I'm like, wait, now she sounds vaguely Spanish? I don't know. And yet, last time I tried practicing, I think I accidentally made her sound Russian. Celia's just... Let's just say Celia's a traveler to justify my <laughs> attempt at her accent. The poor thing really is stressed. God, that sounds so Russian. She started talking to herself. Hush you. I'm thinking out loud. I'll be working on the details of this quest and give it to you tomorrow. So we're just going to help whoever needs us? That's a lot of people. That and... Oh, please investigate the latest attempted break-in. She said please. She seems to be in an exceptionally good mood. It's all... Oh, that's Vera. Gosh darn it, why did I think that was Reniel? <laughs> she seems to be in an exceptionally good mood. It's almost scary. Hmm, but what kind of mold? Mold. Gosh darn it, all these voices. Mold. Keep an eye on her, will you, Celia, dear? You can count on me when I'm not busy with my clients. Speaking of... Celia is ready for business. Her massage parlor will ooh will bring in extra money at the end of each day, provided she is well advised. Gauge her mood, advise an approach, and see the money flow in. Nice. There are so many items I want to buy, like the fruit vendor at the main market in the city. When Celia feels happy, she can work extra hard and see many clients. Careful, this fox girl tires easily. When it happens, tell her to take it easy for the day. Whatever you do, make sure she never feels death. God, okay. I assume that just means, like, fatigue. I hope. If you want to increase her profits, tell Celia to promote her services. She will spend the day chatting with potential clients. She will make more money in the future. Celia looks ready to please. Alright, it's the first day. Oh wait, should we say work hard or promote your services? Does anyone even know she's open yet? I want to say work hard, but... Let's be more businessy. Understood. To receive a share of her profits, don't forget to talk to Celia every day before you go adventuring. She will automatically give you part of the profits at the end of each day. You'll also unlock special dialogue with her. Cool. By the way, I'm gonna readjust real quick. I realize now why. Oh, come on. Okay, you know what? Whatever. I wanted to see the chat box, but. Wait a minute, I have a second monitor. I can just put it on the second monitor. There we go. Okay, cool. Here's Renia. Sparky, what quest? What quest do we have today? Carrie wants some help in Brightway. 
We must assist her. Agreed. Her uncle also wants to talk with you. Tam's brother. Does he have a quest for us? Not really. I'm not sure how it's classified since I can't look at the board. I am the board. But I think that if you help him, you'll get some nice stuff in return. Let's do that then. I want to play with his wolfies again. I don't... <laughs> mutter mutter. Meow is still entrapped with a mold. Hmm, strange. It seems that now you're able to help someone in Sienna. Sienna. Don't know how to say it, but we'll oscillate between the two. It must be Fern. Maybe we can pick the roses she wanted. Oh yeah, we didn't get to see the royal gardens last time. A visit to the royal gardens of the capital is in order then. I wonder, if I had a rose to gift, who would I gift it to? Maybe seeing all the roses in the capital will make up my mind. While you're there, you can also help a gallant lad called Leon. A fellow lover of all things of beauty. And abs! Sunny giggles. You'll have a busy day. I also sense a great deal of helplessness in the rotting woods. Please go there and make sure that everything is alright. Well then, ladies, ready to make the five girls one ghost proud? So we have a lovely guilt name. <laughs> Alright, let's see. They said to talk to the fox girl. I'll do my best. Okay, I thought we had more dialogue. And don't forget to visit the Royal Gardens in, of Northwood. Fernwood likes the roses and it's the only place that has them. Wow, roses are really rare in this world. But where can I find the mold? Hmm, didn't Fleming collect it in a swamp? All right, our scientist at work. Oh cool, he's right here for us. It's Tam's brother. One day I'll muster the courage to ask for his name. <laughs> I forgot what voice I did for him. Lassies, or should I say five girls, one ghost? It's wonderful to see you. Oh, um. I see that you have been to the Emerald Maze. Did you put the treasure chests in there? He looks the other way. Thank you for the items. <laughs> They're nothing but silly trinkets. I was talking with Tam the other day. I think you're ready to continue. Right, he put a log in the middle of the road. We could have jumped over it, but that would have been terribly impolite. <laughs> I like the justifications of, like, the mechanisms of the world. A word of advice. Trust your ears. Huh. Cool. Alright, let's take a look at our... Wait, we failed a quiz? What? Okay, I didn't do this one because it was implied that we didn't have to. I didn't realize we could have done it anyway. So there is like a tunnel on the way to Rosedell, I believe that's the name of like the kind of icy village that we're sending lost souls to. Interesting. And yet when we get to Rosedell, either Dana or the guard were like, oh, it's actually being dealt with. So I'm like, oh cool, I don't need to do it. But apparently we could have done it anyway and gotten a reward. Okay. Whatever. Okay. So what do we have for today? So this is a long-term one. Oh yeah, we're still setting up the crystals. Go to Marvin. Investigate the break-ins. The rotting woods. Dana. Yes, okay, yeah, Rosedale's her village. Uh, objective. Oh, okay, that's the long term one. Just keep finding people to send to Dana. Brightway. Carrie needs our help. Something's happened in the cave, but she can't leave her post to find out herself. Brightway. Leon in the market. And would you help? Oh my god, so many plant puns. Okay, just visit our. Our plant folks. Okay. Let's go to the woods first, because they're like right next to us. Is there anything up here? 
Okay, there is a quest up here. Stay back, I don't want it. What's going on? Why is he attacking us? He doesn't look like he wants to. Ch charmed. You've been charmed. He seems to be trying to rebel against it. Can we do something about it? But of course. Oh, that was fast. I thought we had to fight him. He passed out. He doesn't seem injured. I was very delicate with him. Something is poking out from his collar. It's a piece of paper with a sketch of a rather handsome man surrounded by hearts. He's a pretty good artist. Hmm. It seems he sketched the subject of his affections. Most likely the man who charmed him. Do you think it was an incubus? Aren't they incredibly rare? He could also be a charm wizard. Is this related to the break-in? Unlikely, but we should probably keep our eyes peeled for him. Let's call Tom and have her help the guard. My goodness, charmed, you say? I show her the sketch of the man. Have you seen him anywhere? What a handsome fellow. Impossible to miss. I wasn't in Marvin yesterday, so I might have done just that. Handsome, she says. My, my. We'll leave the guard in your capable hands. Of course, loves. Mm, maybe we should ask the Guild Affairs office about the man. Show them the sketch and ask for advice. Yes, let's do that. But first, let's go to the woods, because they're right next to us. The Rotten Woods, the Blue Earths. I think it's up here. Oh, no, that's the Elder Tree. It's this way. Oh my god, hey, get out of the way! Okay. Wait. Rotting woods, I thought... Okay, well let's just go to the town here, because I think we have the crystal. <laughs> Do we have the crystal in the rotting woods? Let's see. There's the emerald maze. Which I think is different. Okay, here's the rotting woods, we'll just teleport there. Oh, this is okay. This is where we were chasing. It came from the swamp south of here. Let's not waste any time. Herbs. Okay, south of here. Uh, no, I don't want to fight everyone. Hmm. I mean, there's not really something directly south of here, but. I guess we can go this way? Oh, Rotting Woods to the left. Rotting Woods spawn to the spot. There's nothing to the south. Okay, maybe we go first to the left? Oh, there is a place. Oops. Here, the toxic fumes of the swamp won't be an issue now. Help's on the way! Radio, my ears. Can we cross anywhere? Uh, and it seems like the right play- oh! Cool. I accidentally did that, but looks like we were supposed to. Alright, let's fight the spider and get those herbs. Also, we've never fought a spider before. Let's see, let's try... All eyes. Good spot right now. Let's see. What do we have here? Okay, cool, thank you. 
Pixie Mix. I just had it there we go. Heal the party. Well, we need more matted fur. Here, take this. <laughs> Stats refers to poison. Removes numerous negative stats. I hope it removes poison. Okay, cool, it does. But I can only do it on one person. <laughs> Use an item on her. Okay. <laughs> oh, come on. Oh. Oh, it is charmed now. It might not attack. No, it attacked. It was a bad attack. were a little harder than I thought they'd be. <laughs> now we know what spiders are like. Oh, nice, matted fur. It's exactly what I need. I think I'll still buy more when I'm back in town. Sticky goo. Oh, come on. <laughs> now that I just fought spiders, I kind of don't want to fight them again. Ooh, herbs. Herbs, 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 Get the herbs. Get mechanical. Mechanical, no! No! <laughs> okay. Uh, <laughs> I mean, I'll probably level up the next- no, no, oh my god. I'll probably level up the next time I fight, but I don't know how much further I have to walk. There's another hole? Or is that- no, that's another one, huh. We probably have to go down there. Oh, there's a third one, what? Okay, is this a post? That's a deep hole. If only we had a rope. Oh, interesting. So we need to go down there eventually. Oh, come on. I don't think we're fully healed. I think I can actually heal outside of battle. Uh, let's see. Items. Oh, it tells us what it... Antis, whatever. Huh, it doesn't list poison, but it did help with poison. Interesting. Okay. We have five of these. Okay. And why not? Let's save, because this might be a big battle. Make a new one twelve. Okay. Just in time. Why does it say times one when we have huh, so many 
Raises strength. I really like Raises Evasion a lot. Probably Raises Defense, and we only have one leather. And Magic Fur is like my go to. I think we have enough if I keep using Magic Fur. <laughs> Let's raise our evasion. Let's take the battle. And I wonder if they do nature attacks because the buff also goes protects us from nature attacks. Uh, Alright, let's take out one. Man, now it feels like overkill. You know what? We should really just get rid of him. Their defense lowers their agility. They haven't made that one yet. Weakens one enemy. And okay. See, we haven't done that one. Let's see what happens. Ooh, curse of vulnerability. Ha. Huh. Don't we still have a baby? I thought you guys still had plus evasion, don't you dare <laughs> You wish! I need to heal up. Okay. Which one is your weakest? 740. Seems like I have learned just a sip. Oh, cool. Learned a new move. Oh, because she leveled up. The man passed out. He has some scratches and bruises, but no serious injuries. He's holding something in his hand. It's a rare herb that requires toxic water to grow. Why does he need it? His mask. I think he's one of the doctors working in Florel. Let's carry him out of here. We got to room for the man at the Happy Rooster. I hope he'll feel better soon. My, he's a heavy sleeper. He must have been overwhelmed by the fumes from the swamp. Thank you again for that protection spell. Agreed, your dear. 
months and he smiles sweetly. I told the innkeeper to check on him regularly. Hopefully he'll be able to return to Florel and work on a cure for the plague. Yay, quest complete. And now we're at the Happy Rooster. Welcome to the Happy Rooster. No, we don't need a room. I feel like I've sp spoken to these people before. <laughs> yes, they sound familiar. Cool, I think we're in the capital now. Oh my god. Are these just free- oh, they're not free bits. <laughs> I was gonna say, I think we're in the capital now, and there is the Rose Garden. I think we go north, although let's talk to you. You here for that noble job? Good. Meet me here in three days. It's very specific. Okay, I hope I remember. It's probably on my quest list, but... <laughs> Try to remember. <laughs> oh, cool. Okay. You can just walk right in. This must be the head gardener. She looks like the lady from the quest guild. We'll just say they're sisters, I guess. <laughs> Hi there, honeybee. Hmm? I point at the beautiful flowers around us. We were wondering where one could purchase the seeds of such gorgeous roses. Uh, these are a crossbreed between local and Belegian roses. They're one of a kind. Surely there must be some seeds available? You girls don't seem qualified to process the seeds or make anything grow from them. Well, you're not wrong. You're lucky that anyone can grow roses from bare roots. If you buy them potted, it's even easier. Well, where can we find those? We are in your green thumb tans, miss. Follow me, then. Oh, wait. How much will the roots cost us? They will cost you your silence. Our silence? Does that mean... Are you going to give us the roots of these rare roses? Won't you get in trouble for that? I love them. I would like to see them in every corner of the kingdom. So, I'm going to free them from their royal cage. Just don't tell anyone you got them from me. How does that sound? You're a romantic under that pragmatic exterior. We accept, of course. Pick your favorite. The purple rose- oh, that's sunny. The purple roses are stunning. Look, look! The white roses look so fresh! You're supposed to pick one, not bring the whole shed with you. Hmm. <clears throat> it doesn't happen to specify in our quest which ones to get. Probably not. Let's see. Hmm. Which one is it? Oh, the would you help us? Interesting hidden quest. I wonder if it's because we spoke to them after the main quest. Not so much do that seeds bring her any we find. Interesting. So I guess we'll find more roses on the way. We can start with roses from the Northwood Castle Gardens. Huh. The white roses are interesting. Do you have a recommendation? The white roses look fresh. The purple roses are stunning. I love how eager Renia was, but I do think the purple ones have a very regal look to them. Sunny seems to like these. Just like around some more. Renia seems to like the red roses a lot. I feel bad disappointing Renia. <laughs> oh, interesting. Taya might like them. Or not. Celia might like these. They remind me of Lyra's scarf. When are we going to meet Lyra again? Like, she's such an interesting character. I want to see her again. The meaning of orange roses is broad enough for everyone to like them. Huh. I'm kind of tempted because this reminds her of Lyra. I wonder if we might, like, unlock special dialogue with Lyra. If we were to get these. Alright, we'll pick the yellow ones. I just- I just chose- Oh, okay. I've made my choice. I like the yellow roses. Nice. Here you are. Now, get out of here before anyone sees you. 
so tender with the flowers, yet so curt with us. <laughs> Let's bring the roses to Fern after we explore. Ooh, what's that? Well, we can just walk on this. I don't think we're supposed to just walk on that, but okay. Do you reckon I can fish here? Let's make him southern because he sounds like a southern man. Come into the royal gardens to fish. <laughs> I'm overwhelmed by the grandeur of this castle. This is cute, this little balcony. Can we cross the lily pads? No, we can't. Oh, there's a... Not a duck, a swan. <laughs> cute. Well, it looks like a swan and a duck. Or a swan and a baby swan. This place is begging for a romantic rendezvous. Pumpkin, this place is guarded. <laughs> okay. Nice. This is a really cute area. Ooh, there's the guards up there. I really like the detail of the garden. <clears throat> cool. Kudos to the game developers for adding so much nice little detail to that. Alright. Let's see. So I think we need to go to Sienna. Sienna. Let's see if there's anything else here. The Northwood Fountain Square. Yes. Okay, so I think we need to wait a couple of days. Oh, Leon! Who's in the Market Plaza? We're in Northwood. Brightway is... somewhere else. So many quests. Okay, let's go first to the... oops. The square. <clears throat> the Market Plaza, that was what I meant. Leon, there you are. Leon has another request for us. Five girls, one ghost. My saviors. Leon's shirt gets destroyed by his sudden flexing and falls in sad tatters to the ground. Looking buff, your pecs are growing in size. Are they? Excellent. I've been training under a new regime. It's terribly intense yet so satisfying. Maybe I should tell you about it later. Yes, please. How did the flower delivery go, dear? It was a success! My tussled and damp hair stole my lover's breath away, and I look rather dashing with the lilies, if I say so myself. How delightful! I'm happy to hear that all went well. We saw that you had another request for us. Do we need to dunk you into the canal again? <laughs> Sunny seemed a little eager for that. Leon shivers. How can she say such terrible things with that sweet smile of hers? <laughs> no such thing. I need you to investigate ways to safely dispose of unwanted items. I tilt my head. I mean trash. How to clear it away discreetly. It's lambskin, if it, um, helps. Leon scratches his head. I still live with my parents, so... Oh. Oh, poor thing. What do you need to throw away? Renia looks so innocent. I almost feel bad. Compromising items. Don't worry, Leon. We are not stitches. Unless you're killing someone. In that case, we are. The occasion... The occasional little death is a cause of charm. <laughs> okay, I don't know if this is... Uh, what's it called? Euphemism, I guess? I remember learning from a... Not rom-com, like, I don't know, TV show that my mom was watching that apparently in French... I'm totally basing this on this, like, cheesy TV show that I did not look this up myself, but apparently in French... I hope I don't get in trouble for saying... I'm not gonna get in trouble, this is like sex ed, this is educational. Apparently, orgasm in French literally translates to little death, or at least there's a phrase in French that literally means little death, referring to an orgasm. So, I've never heard that used in English, but... I suspect that's what Vera is referring to. 
The occasional little death is a cause of joy, not mourning. In any case, you want to know a safe and discreet way to dispose of personal items. Again, if you're not a French speaker or if you haven't watched shows that allude to that, you might miss that reference. But I am here to educate you on these euphemisms. Very well, we will work hard to help you. You still don't know what he's talking about, do you? Intimate articles for couples, dear. Oh. Oh! Rayel <laughs> blushes furiously. He could have said so. We are all adults here. It's hard to come up on the spot with an elegant verbiage for such items. That implies you've thought about the appropriate verbiage before. Of course I did. I'm a charm witch, am I not? The term novelties implies objects of a certain size. And of course there's the term <clears throat> enhancements. But those are easy to hide in a flask. Um, so... How are we going to investigate throwing out garbage? Good question. Sunny. I have some ideas, but I doubt you would consider them very... ethical. She taps her chin pensively. Perhaps we could look into acids. It's impossible to recognize items once they have been melted. Do you know a lot about that stuff? Sunny's bright smile is filled with mischief. Perhaps. I love her little derpy smile. Where can we find such acids? I read up on the Emerald Maze. It has a wide variety of aggressive vegetation. That's our best bet. We still have a... I hope you'll find something. Okay, so I guess we come back to him. Where's our fruit vendor? I want to say it's this guy. How much money do I have? Ooh, I do have lots of money. Okay. I don't know if he only has one of each item, because I think I can only give one fruit to one character. So, permanently increases max health. Regularly consume academics, max mana. Strength. I hope I can buy two apples. Because Sunny is definitely squishy, but so is Vera to an extent. Let's see. Can I buy oh, I can buy two. Yes. Okay. I love you, Reniel, but you're our tank. You don't really need it as much. <clears throat> okay. Is it in here? I guess it is. Long it to the apple. Use on Sunny, and also on Vera. Nice. Cool. Okay, that's awesome. That implies that he has an unlimited supply of fruits. I plan to buy more. <laughs> okay. Um. Is there so many quests to do today? Let's just tackle the ones we have right now. We can teleport quite easily, so we don't need to be too systematic. <clears throat> okay, so. Ah, uh, we still haven't found where in the Emerald Maze to put our teleporty thingies. Alright. The farmland and then from here, the maze. Wait a minute. Whoa. I forgot how attached they were. Okay, whatever from Mob, then it's just. We just cross over this way. So do we just fight mushrooms? Is that all we're doing? Let me double check. Uh... Oh, whoops, we were right there. Oh wait, that's just... Okay, never mind. We didn't have to go to the fair's office. We're still doing the crystal one for that. Go to Marvin. Oh, this was also the affairs office. We were right there. Okay, but... Rose Okay, this is what we're on right now. <sighs> Sunny thinks that some sort of acid might do the trick. 
just fight, I guess. Oh, they said plants, but oh, I think these guys, the, I think we have to fight these guys. Wow, he was Enemies. on What? That one was still alive. Maybe she is using magic to power up. Interesting. I never thought about it till now. Oh, wow. This guy has, like, no damage. Okay, let's charge up. dancing around. We didn't get acids from that either. Unless we have to go on. No, 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 let me leave. Let me go down. Do we have to go to that little C 
secret place. He heals. Much better. Do you have a little arrows? Healing arrows. I don't remember there being this little walkway before. Huh, okay, I think this is new. <clears throat> I don't think it was there last time. If it was, I totally missed it, but I don't think it was here last time. If you ever get lost, take the left twice. Listen, oh, listen to the forest song and be careful. One path leads to riches, one to a challenge. Okay, let me up my volume and listen here. Okay, if you get lost, go to left twice. So maybe that resets the maze. We'll do that. Listen to the song, be careful. One path to riches, one to a challenge. Okay, let's go here twice. See if it resets. Oh, hello. Oh my god! Be careful. Okay. Well, they, I think they did say we would need flowers to find the acid. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Why does one of them have to look so creepy? Let's get rid of the creepy one first. That's called a creeping man trick. Of course it is. Okay. Is there like a limit to how many buffs I can use? Because now it's just not listed. It was like times one last time, which I now realize meant you can use it one more time. I don't know if there's a limit per day or if I sleep it resets. That sucks. Elemental primer. Okay, well, we have a lot of shark teeth. Let's see what it does. This is going to hurt. Oh boy, what did I do? Let's... Okay. I really hope I can slap it, but I don't know. I just want to get rid of it. Okay. Uh, I feel like I should actually heal. I like to think that we just got rid of the more dangerous one, so let's see how this goes. Sip of an enemy's life and drink. Oh, that's the one I just learned. I keep needing to remember to scroll down. Oh, wait, I didn't even need to do that because I wasn't injured yet. Ah, oh, whatever. Okay. Uh, I gotta remind myself to do that for Vera, though, because she does get squishy.
Did we get asked? I didn't pay attention. Okay, well, let's over again. Okay, so that just resets. Does this heal us? Wait, I forgot. Much better. Yes, cool. It replenishes everything. Okay. So. Listen to the forest song. Be careful. So, I don't know if this is like Zelda, like the Lost Woods where the music gets louder as you get close to the right direction. to the forest song. I feel like it's not changing based on where I walk. Okay, now the song's getting so quiet, I hardly hear anything. What am I listening for? I hear birds. Let's see. Probably don't go the same way. I hear birds again. Okay, that's, I hope it's the birds. Herbs. I hear birds again. Do we hear them here? Okay, but I also hear birds that way. Okay, that's the only bird one. I hear birds again, but I don't think I want to go the same way I came. Let's see. Huh. Interesting. This is the only place I heard birds. Do I want to- I just came that way. Huh, okay. Cool. The sign reads, You managed to f Oh, is that the dude's voice? You managed to find the treehouse. It's a bit discrepant, but make yourselves at home. And feel free to take the stuff in the chest. Cool. Here's a mighty rare thing I found. There's that the dude's voice. A tablet that makes throwing rocks special. Doesn't one of you play markswoman with stones? Tablet of David. <laughs> okay. Magic water is rare outside of Marvin. Tam gave me some. Here, for you. Cool. That's nice of him. Uh, let's see. What am I looking for? Equipment? Is it technically equipment? Wait, you don't have an accessory equipped? What? Okay. Allow Sunny to throw heavier rocks that have even less chance to hit that are always critical. Oh, boy. 
Okay, you should have this. This is why I chose save file 10, because I wanted her to have that. Okay, let's make sure, okay, everyone has something equipped. I'm not sure if my mic's picking it up. My neighbor's dog is very excited right now. So if you are hearing that, use my neighbor's dog. He's just excited. I think I just heard them come home. Much better. Wait a minute. Okay. Is this not somewhere we can put one of our st- Oh my god. Seriously? I want to see if we could put our stone at the, not the castle, the treehouse. <laughs> okay, um, let's save right before it. The rock wasn't that hard when we had to fight it, but still. Just to be safe. I think we have one file 12. And where in the woods of the maze do we put the stones, the teleportation stones? Because I feel like maybe the treehouse would have been one, but I didn't notice when I was there. I didn't think to look. I seek, I seek a pure-hearted maiden. That would be Renio. <laughs> Beautiful elf whose name I do not know, are you ready to face me alone? I guess there's not an option to face it alone. Sorry, Reniel, I guess there's not an option for you to face it alone. You really have to fight, Mr. Unicorn? Oh, it does have to go alone. I guess we're just hyping her up. Not to the death, really. This is but a test. I did not expect that voice for him. The orb is there to aid you. How? How does the orb aid me? Okay. I'm gonna try go, this. Go, go. orb aid me. Come back when you are stronger. When you are stronger, you need to best be to place your crystal here. Oh. Wow, okay, do I have to level up like 50 times to beat him? Because how is that orb supposed to aid? Let's try it one more time. How do I use that orb? Not to the orb is there to aid you. How? How does it aid me? Is it... How? I don't understand how the orb aids... Oh wow. Reniel's at one health. Whatever. I guess if I survive around, the orb will help. Alright. Well, yeah, we're not strong enough for that yet. No! Want to have some fun? I guess we'll come back some other time. Okay, so 
maybe the treehouse is where one goes. Definitely the unicorn at some point. So it's possible we're just not advanced enough to place the second orb. And then the first orb would go to the unicorn. Interesting. Like the treehouse seems very suspicious. But I, I don't know, I feel like it would have been more obvious. If it went there. I'm sure I can find something. Okay, Raniel has good defense. Are quite a bit. <laughs> yeah, Sunny is so squishy. Interesting. I guess like every few battles it comes back. I can only do it twice though. Let's, let's save that up. Let's see, we don't know what that one does. We don't know what this one does. Let's try this one. Stop it. Nice. Melts your defense is what? coming here was to get acid. I don't think the unicorn was the acid. Okay. Stop! What Why are they happen? so aggressive? So this heals a little, but it also dispels negative effects. Apparently not the current negative effect we have. Wow, the 
barely did anything. Since one of them stunned, we can afford to charge you up. We fought the mushroom, we fought one of those guys, we didn't get acid from any of them. Let us know, let us out. Okay, what is... We must help Leon dispose of the incriminating evidence of his intimate encounters. I haven't given this a full read. Sunny thinks that some sort of acid might do the trick. I thought it was supposed to be a drop from the maze, the emerald maze, because then this is just another entrance to the same maze. Well, let's, whatever, we're almost done. No, leave me alone. Ah, oh, whoops. Okay, well, Marvin's on the other side. Pretty much a Marvin's. Bright way, whatever. Ah, Brightly. Was there something at Brightway before we teleport back to Leon and ask him for help? Okay. King Guild office. I confused Marvin with Brightway. Rosedale Brightway. Carrie needs our help. Something has happened in the cave, but she can't leave her post to find out. Okay, we're here, Carrie. Where are you? Is that Carrie at the cave? Oh, Carrie is as lovely as ever. I've missed her. I should tell her as much. Carrie, my dear, it's good to see you. She giggles. Five girls, one ghost. I was waiting for you. You look a bit bummed out. Is everything okay? Yes and no. I'm okay, but I'm worried. What happened? She points at the entrance of the cave. The cave changed. Changed. The water inside drained somehow. Perhaps a daring villager did it. There are too many monsters in there. Nobody would dare approach it. It's so close to the houses. Isn't it dangerous? The monsters don't attack humans. They have a weakness for small animals. I flash her a smile infused with some extra pheromones to distract her. We'll get to the bottom of it. I'm not a big fan of caves, but this one seems big enough. Thank you. I'd come along, but I'm on guard duty as well. Today as well. Take these just in case. Mom always gives me too many. Oh, that's generous. And ominous. Is this going to be really hard? Man-made relics in an abandoned cave. Fishy, isn't it? Let's read what's on the stone slab. How do I get down there? I go up here? Is that what the slab says? Cry, wanting beast, for your throat is arid and your scream released. From the warm embrace of your beloved, her corpse lay still where you shoved it. What a macabre love poem. Are you sure it's about love? Let's read it again. Cry, wanting beast, for your throat is arid and your scream released. From the warm embrace of your beloved, her corpse lay still where you shoved it. Sounds like it's mocking the beast for not being able to save its beloved. <laughs> Excuse me, that was a water break. It feels like a riddle. A riddle. It's telling us to do something. You're right. 
We should shove each other, pretend to cry, and I'd have to scream. Shoot, I wish I could read it again. I think it started saying cry, beast. Hmm. Close your ears. I thought it meant cry, like sob, but okay. Sunny's yell echoes in the cave. Eek! I feel like... <laughs> what happened to the floor around us? The throat of the beast is arid. Arid. Red, okay. So by stepping on the tiles, we're quenching the beast's thirst. Let's make them all change. I think we need to be careful and plan a path. Okay, well, um, I have an idea how to start. I have to get these corners. I feel like I just needed to, hmm, okay, well, actually here, I need to kind of, huh, let's see if I go up and then zigzag down. Okay, I think I can do that. Some stairs just appeared. Wonderful. I hear some crawling noises. Oh no. Let's stay close to each other. Where are the stairs? Wait. You just saw stairs, but I don't see stairs. Where did the stairs come? Oh, it's the giant. Okay, I thought it was stairs going to the tablet. Spider. Is that a crab? Looks kind of cute, actually. Oh, there's crabs everywhere. I don't think I want to fight all of them. Is that a mana thing? Yes. Cool. Okay, so. Ah, uh, whatever. Let's see. I hope they're not hard. Please don't be hard. At least there's the mana thing we can heal each time. Why? Okay, let's get rid of the red guy. Wait, can I not enchant the red one? Do I have to get the armored ones first, I guess? Huh. Interesting. Save the mana here though. Let's do the fire one. What a clever breed. Nice. Okay, cool. They can attack twice. Or at least that one did. Okay, well that was able to break it. Interesting. Well, it's dizzy, so let's take advantage of it. It tends to drown you, what? Dude, what? Let's 
so many sharp teeth. This is what keeps throwing fire. Go down the map so I can get those herbs. Go down the map. No, oh my god! Be careful! Uh, whatever. It's a good opportunity to level up. Oh, uh, yay, yay. Okay, so, note to self as strong as Reniel is, we need magic to break these barriers. do anything because he still has the magic thing in the burp on him. Is this gonna like offset my charge probably? Where did, okay, I'm like where did you go? That worked last time. just surged into the cave. Where, where? Interesting, I wasn't expecting that. I thought I had to just keep roaming, but I guess by defeating... This wasn't here before. I've got heal first. Which one is me? Oh. Shuffle, shuffle. I can t it can talk. It's so ancient. It's developed a consciousness. Jar thingy? Uh, what should we do? I think it wants us to pick a jaw, but which one? Like it can we heal first? Thank you. <laughs>
Oh my, what a treat. We don't need to fight, do we? I don't think we have a choice. She is here as a guardian. Um, let's see if we can knock one out. Water protection, water spirit, water control. Uh, I hope she can't summon more. Let's try to get rid of at least one of these on the first. How is it still alive? How? Ay ay ay. Can you please throw a rock at it? Okay, actually, let's um, do mixing mix. Works on multiple targets. Fire against water? I don't know if that would be good or not very effective. What a clever brain. Okay, that would have Okay. Yeesh. Okay, well this... Oh, the main one has a uh, shield, so we can put this down. Still alive, wow. Oh. Or I guess we can group heal. Why not do this one? Come, group. Oh, come on. Do the other one. The other one. Well, at least the other one's dazed. Um, healing restores the party. Yes. This will help. No, it's doing it again. Okay, well. Actually, let's cut both of them. So we'll cut both of them. Yeah, okay, I think fire is not very effective against it. It was just enough to get rid of one of them earlier, but not very effective. That or this is just a really strong one. Or both. Probably both. Oh wait, we're still enchanted, so let's suck. Static might be good against water. What a clever brain. Oh wow, yes it is. Okay, come on. No! Come on! Like, can we use static against all of them? Got him up. Well, 
that's taken care of, <clears throat> let's explore the rest of the cave. That was very matter of fact. Another stone slab. This time in a language I don't recognize. Let's report back. You're back. We reached a deeper level of the cave. So there is a second level. Some of the scholars that were investigating the cave months ago told us as much. They never found a way to access it. Should I be worried? We dispatched the creature that was guarding the place. I'll let you know if anything crawls out of there. I don't like to fight monsters, but if I have to, I will. Here's your reward. You sound so reliable. Careful, or you'll steal my heart away. No comment. <laughs> no, there's nothing down here, is there? Oh, there's the boat. Cool, so we did that. Let's go back to Northwood, and Leon, can you give us more direction on what to do? And we do have to meet someone here, but Leon first. Before we get too sidetracked. Alright, Leon, give us a hint, man. I hope you'll find something. Okay, come on, man. Can I talk to Sunny? I feel like Sunny said, like, the emerald may- wait, emerald- yeah, that's where we were, right? Okay, there's someone here to talk to. Except they don't have an exclamation mark above their head. We just- oh wait, we can go up here too. Alright, I guess we just talk to you. Is that cool? Oh my god, good. Okay, so they do look- I was thinking- I mean, they look different, but this girl looks pretty similar to the gardener. I feel like- I mean, as much as Reniel's, like, tan, we don't have too many dark characters in the game, so it stood out to me. I'm like, oh, this character and the gardener are, like, are ambiguously brown characters of the game. It would be interesting if there's, like, any relation between them. It would be interesting too, we don't really know much of like the different kingdoms pertaining to like different races and such. Like not just among humans but even elves and humans. I'm curious if they'll- anyhow. Seeing the character designs I'm like I'm curious if they're gonna really touch on that at all or if just the world is very like mixed which I got the impression this world, as much as there's different kingdoms, there's really not much of, like, strict barriers between the kingdoms. Because we read about there, like, being old wars, but I got the impression that was, like, way back in the day. Especially given there's, like, a whole museum above us right here of, like, all these relics from the wars. It's curious. It's a very well-developed world, but I'm curious how much they'll touch on, like, the history of, like, interactions among kingdoms and such. Character designs making me very curious what the history of the world is like. The receptionist of the Guild Affairs office greets us with a smile. Five girls, one ghost. Welcome. How can I help you? I show her the sketch of the man. We're looking for this person. We were wondering if the office could do anything to help us. Do we, like, need to follow a special procedure? We're not sure the person depicted has committed any crimes yet. We know he's either a charm wizard or an incubus. How urgent is your request? We can't really spare the mound power at the moment. The new guild tests are a drain on our resources. We have first-hand experience with that. Your best bet is probably to ask around. I'm not sure strangers would appreciate that. The town's guard has already asked around Morven, yet nothing has come to light. I thank you for your help. Well, that was a waste of time. Wow, careful, she might hear you. The poor woman looks swamped. I'm sure it will take the office a while to get used to the new workload. Meanwhile, we suffer. I'm sure they have several records about incubi and charm wizards. Classified, I assume. We can try again tomorrow. Maybe I'm done. Maybe I should use my own brand of persuasion. Oh, quest complete, even though we didn't find anything. 
Sorry, I can't let you access the records at the moment. Have you checked the tutorials in the guild library? We have normal books as well. I think I did read those last time. Alright. Okay, this one's just long term. Find more people. Where's the acid? Location with the megaphones. Acid might do the trick. Can we buy acid? I could have sworn they said to go to the emerald maze. Right? Emerald forest maze. Let's see, Northwood Fountain Square. I'll have to come back in a couple of days. This one's ready to turn in and the Guild Affairs Office, we have been given to the Okay, that one's ongoing. Okay, so basically two left. Finding acid. And then going to Siana to return with that thing. Okay, let's see if maybe we can buy the acid. Just seems like a solid number of each item. Okay, you don't have acid. I feel like these guys wouldn't, they're just like arm vendors. Evasion is the next one I have. I wish I could equip more than just four items per person. It's not really like an emerald forest, it's just the emerald maze. Hmm. Interesting. Also, we still have crystals to set out, but there's really... Like, the maze hasn't shown us anywhere to put them yet. Alright, well, I guess we'll go to our wood folk and see on a... I'm gonna go in the building. is looking for healing herbs and sharp we have a lot of sharp teeth if you have resources we have money we have many sharp teeth and you want roses I totally forgot we can come to them every day for stuff Fern looks at our bag and hums I totally forgot what voice I gave her the scent the roses you brought are the real deal. <laughs> sure they are. Straight from the king's own gardens. Reniel, that was supposed to stay a secret. Oops. You didn't hear anything, did you? Not a thing. I give Alicia the roots. She moves to a corner and starts digging into the ground to plant the roots. 
How long will it take them to grow and blossom? I'll use my powers. They will be lush and beautiful in no time. Time. Oh wait, is it pronounced time? <laughs> I can hardly wait. She looks so delighted. It warms my heart. Thank you for making the glade a little less lonely for Fern. I don't really have a reward at hand. Your smiles are the best reward we could ask for. I am rather fond of Alicia's smile as well. She's still busy planting the roots, but I can just see her cheeks turn bright red from here. Oh my, what a development. Come back tomorrow. I will let you have the most beautiful rose. Oh, that's cute. How gracious. Thank you. If you, at least, if you have any animal parts you don't use, I can turn them into fertilizer. Just say the word. Yes, let's restore the glade to its former glory. I look forward to it. All right. Let's see how many animal parts. How many? Er, where are we? How many teeth do we have? Oh, we can. Oh, here we go. Wow, we have many teeth. Many, many teeth. And healing, healing, healing herbs. Okay, we don't have many of those. Yes, we can give them five, ten, maybe ten more teeth. <laughs> Cute. I'm excited to see how this develops. I'm assuming we'll see more flowers pop up as we give it to them. Okay. Let's see. Any more quests besides the acid? So frustrated with the acid one. Okay, teleportation crystals. Yeah, I don't think we can go to any of the other places, and the maze isn't showing us where to put it yet. Keep finding people for Dana. Whoa. Okay, 10,000 for meeting that noble in a couple days? Bring any seeds or reach find. Okay, so that's ongoing, it looks like. <laughs> a reward. Seeing her smile is priceless. Cute. And the last one is just the acid. Okay, I am curious. The rotting woods. There's so many quests to do today. Oh my goodness. There was that one tunnel. I don't think it has to do with our acid one. But there is that one tunnel where it's like, oh, we need to come back once we have rope. Oh, come on, spider. Leave us alone. Leave us alone. Why'd you have to respawn? Why are you here? Why are you here? Leave us alone. Thank you. Oh, boy. Okay. So there's this one. It's like, come back when you have rope. And what is this one again? Yes, we saved the person and then it sent us back. Oh, because there's nothing here. Wait. We can't cross there, but it implies that there's something if we crossed. Huh. Okay, I guess we have to come back here at another time. I felt like, okay, there was kind of this lead, but not yet, I guess. Man, we have to cross those spiders again. Leave us alone, leave us alone. No, 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 Oh my god. I don't want to fight. I just wanted to see... If we could go down with rope, but we don't have rope. I wonder how we get rope. I don't think that's really an item we can buy. Okay. I wanted to buy some things back home in Marvin. Yes. We have been enjoying matted fur. Ooh, it's expensive, but we've been using it so much, though. Okay. 
Um, do we need anything from Tam? Is Tam here today? Pretty good. Okay. Sometimes Tam disappears for a few days. We haven't been in here in forever. Is there anything new happening? Doesn't really look like it. I haven't talked to this dude forever. I remember like the first day he's like, come back and I'll have more quizzy trivia for you. I have a new trivia test ready, solely in for prizes though. Huh, interesting. I guess at some point we'll have a new trivia. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Where do we find this acid? Can you help us? Yes, yes we are. <sighs> so many jewels. Okay, maybe I misremembered. I'm I'm surprised the quest doesn't like, specify, remind you more. Right here. Because I thought they're like, oh, there's a plant in the emerald maze, and we fought that plant multiple times. Stop. My only other guess is like up here there's something. We'll leave this alone. Oh, come on. Enemies. I don't really like looking up things. Like, I feel like I'm cheating if I look up things, but I think I'll wrap up after this fight. And I'll probably just look up online if there's like a wiki for the, for the game. If the wiki mentions anything. I'm just trying to get past you. No! Oh my god, I totally forgot I can run on you, though. <laughs> they just back away slowly. And I feel like for the Emerald Maze, it might just be a matter of fighting for a while. But I am getting tired, so... I probably can't use that bit, can I? Aw, oh, she's tired. Okay, the next day we'll tell her to take it easy. I wonder if Sparkles can give me a hint. We'll see real quick, but then we'll wrap up soon. Rest. Can I only use the purple bed? Alright, Sparkles. Do you have advice? The Royal Gardens. Okay, well we did that. save right next to Leon to remind myself that we have that quest, the last quest of the day. Ooh, Ostmore looks exciting. 
just realized it's in ruins on there. Oh yes, we all go there for space and out. Okay. Leon, my dude. Man, I wish I could just talk to my party members. I swear Sunny said the maze would probably just have to keep roaming the maze until it randomly drops. Cool. Alright. To title! Alright, this was a bit longer of a stream than usual. It was also a very busy day compared to some of the other days in the game. Cool. We will wrap up here for now. I might look for a hint for the acid. I think it's just a matter of fighting a bunch of things in the maze, but I'd rather be certain, so I'll check that for next time. We'll wrap up here. I'll catch you all next time.